Hey, motherfucker. Die Hard is regarded as one of the best action movies of all time, and it may be true, but it's also walk shit. Reactionary crap. The movie tells the story of John McLean, a New York police detective who flies to Los Angeles to spend the holidays with his wife and his children, but ends up fighting a group of supposed terrorists in an unfinished skyscraper, where his wife is one of the hostages, as often happens when you don't make fist with your toes. Let's go point by point, shall we? John McLean comes to Los Angeles because his wife, Holly, is living there with her kids. She got a really good career opportunity there. And being a policeman in New York, John cannot change cities easily. So he stayed and the wife and the kids left. John McLean comes to Los Angeles because his wife, Holly, is living there with her kids. She's got a really good career opportunity there. And being a policeman in New York, John cannot change cities easily. So he stayed and the wife and the kids left. Of course, John's not very happy about it. And the couple is not in the best of terms either. But he's coming to Los Angeles with a ridiculously large teddy bear trying to win back Holly. Of course, John's not very happy about it. And the couple is not in the best of terms either. But he is coming to Los Angeles with a ridiculously large teddy bear trying to win back Holly. The main emotional theme of the movie is not that Holly must choose between her career and her family, but that Gyeong needs to make peace with the fact Holly's career is as important to her as her family. No more, no less, equally important. The main emotional theme of the movie is not that Holly must choose between her career and her family, but that John needs to make peace with the fact that Holly's career is as important to her as her family. No more, no less. Equally important. Spoiler alert! He, the hard-boiled detective, paradigm of good old-fashioned masculinity, apparently accepts his wife values him, their children and their family just as much as her career. And Holly forgives him. Eh. His prowess and violence makes the couple whole again. Still... Walk shit. Spoiler alert! He, the hard-boiled detective, paradigm of good old-fashioned masculinity, apparently accepts his wife, marries him, their children and their family just as much as her career. And Holly forgives him. Eh. His prowess in violence makes the couple whole again. See? Reactionary crap. 